welcome to part 3 of my EO3 uh, Ryukyu East uh, experiment where we're going is we're trying to colonize America before the Europeans and basically uh, kicking ass and uh, we'll have to see how this will actually go in the end we're currently taking Honduras up here and we should we'll probably end up declaring war on this guy these guys soon probably try and get some more men up here before but uh, we'll have to see we should have superior armies and this guy isn't too shabby of general, so it should perhaps be okay. We'll uh, we'll have to see what we'll do. We will also be uh, exploring a lot in the area, simply to try and uh, find most of the islands, so we can just uh, just start colonizing once we uh, once we're ready. And uh, that's basically what I'll we'll be doing now. Uh, if something happens, I'll of course record it for you, and we'll see what how it ends up. I actually decided that I'll go ahead and uh, try a war against uh, the Aztecs. Uh, I don't know how this will turn out, but it could get interesting. I'll probably not take uh, and lands probably a couple, a couple of provinces at months at most, but not much. I also want to check: can I actually? Uh, no, I cannot uh, embargo them yet, so that's a little bit of pity. They're actually going straight for me, so uh, I'll just uh, stay here and wait for them. Uh, I forgot to actually turn my maintenance up before we started, so this could be bad, but it seems it should be okay. Uh, we should probably slaughter their army. Uh, slaughter and slaughter, we are doing quite well, but it seems we're actually losing. Are we? Nope. We uh, killed 8,000 of their men. Hopefully we'll be able to reg regain our men along with Oromo morale before those 11,000 hit us, because that could hurt quite a lot. And I should probably have my ships over at that side to begin with. Rebels coming towards us. Yeah, they actually. I forgot to build a fortress. Which is too bad. I don't know if we should. Yeah, we should have retreated earlier, much earlier. Still, it seems we are okay for now at least. We'll allow them to regain some uh, government tech 7 has been reached. What I really want to do is uh, release Maya and then uh, quickly declare war on them I guess or try to vassalize them. I don't know. Can also rob quite a lot of money from these guys. But what I'll do now is while my troops are standing we'll build a fortress along with a, armor a armory quite quickly. And hopefully we'll gain enough men to stand against them. They have rebels to deal with, so we'll have to see how this turns out. I ended up using my spies to place a bunch of uh, rebels. I lost one battle, but my rebels saved me, I guess. And as it starts, turns now, it seems that uh, things are turning great. Uh, Trade Tech 9 has been reached. I should probably have done this a long time ago. Uh, yeah, this too. Turn this one down. Uh, my army is uh, weak right now, so that's probably why it's cheap. Still, we need uh, we need it to get nine, and hopefully these guys will uh, will cause enough trouble to actually me being able to white peace out of this one. Because yeah, we'll go ahead and white peace because I don't have any troops to continue fighting. I need to reinforce, and here we'll go ahead and go. We'll go. Uh, we'll go one point three subjects. Lose one stability doesn't really matter much, uh, should be okay. Should probably have parked these guys a long time ago, but as you can see, things are things are okay. Land tech 5, no issues there. And Magistrate should probably also be used, so I'll go ahead and do it now. Good guy just died, and my okay guy, or good guy too, took uh, over. A is the new heir, and uh, he's actually quite good as well. I have a lot of diplomacy rulers, so I'll probably just get Jack for uh, the other game, but still. Uh, we'll have to see. Um, let's see how this goes. We actually survived. Good. Uh, unfortunately, it will seem they actually have dealt with my rebels, which is uh, a pity, more or less. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll just have to sit quietly here for a while and reinforce my army, basically. And uh, I should also go ahead, build fort, build armory, build everything here, and uh, we'll we'll see what we what we really do when the time comes. Merchant complain, we uh, get one point of pluto plutocracy, can't really complain about that. Uh, they, these guys have still problems with uh, the rebels, I believe some of them are still mine. And other than that, I have returned to colonists again, and 
Right now we have the mission protect against Tachibana. I still want a mission that I actually get a core on from uh, Aztec. Um, I'll probably have to uh, have to try and release Maya or something, take four or five counties and then release Maya up here and probably get a core on for attacking them. Or wait until Shani or Aztec breaks up. So basically this is the part that requires luck or uh, patience or basically just waiting. and. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. We'll uh, we'll have to see what we'll do. Seeing as they're in trouble, I'm actually gone ahead and uh, decided to try a secondary war, and I'll go for Pete and Belize simply to get a little bit of a power base. And uh, I also believe Pete is quite a good province when it comes to taxes, so that's also a bonus. And we'll go ahead just seize and fight, and then seize. If we're lucky, we'll pick up a lot of uh, small, just a small 1k armies. And that's basically what we'll be aiming for, Ta picking down these small armies and just creating trouble for them, basically. Even though they reinforce quite fast, I have to say, it just pops up one after another here. I'll have to call these guys in. We'll execute the bailiff still. We should win this battle. We should. No, we lost. We lost it actually. So, can I uh, offer some tribute? Can I actually give it? They will accept mixtech. Mixtech actually. So, will they offer if I cancel it? Um, twenty percent. No. It actually happened with Mystic, and I don't really need an ally. So we'll go ahead and give them Mystic. I'll get two provinces. I can try to. Uh, it should be okay. And I'll offer you my vassal. There we go. We're both happy. Uh, perhaps I'm not too happy though, because it will take a while to reinforce my army again. But still, it should be okay. Hopefully. We'll, uh, we'll have to see how it works out in the end. There we go. Defeated those rebels. We'll go to Belize now and uh, try to build a fortress here. Same with uh, Pet Peton. And I'll just go ahead and do that. As you see, Terry <laughs> Trade Technology 10 was just reached. And we also have built fortresses and uh, armories in these two. Just an armory in Peton remaining. Still uh, could have gone better. I believe I can cancel my mission now. So we'll establish trade in Malacca actually. Huh. Let's have a look on the ledger and find trade. Cots Malacca. Uh, okay, we'll go ahead and do it. I didn't know that I actually had the, actually had other places to go to too. Uh, Kyoto, can we do this with? And hopefully we'll get some more money out of it. Uh, I need to save up soon to uh, start saving up for capital loot switch and uh, trading in fish. Maintain shipping routes, so we need more ships. Uh, a galley, I believe, should be enough. So we'll just go ahead and build that one. I believe, I believe it should be enough. I'm not sure, but I believe. So we'll uh, we'll wait and see. But uh, also, I have changed to uh, military drill my idea simply because I believe it's morale I'm losing on in uh, my battles against uh, subtex. So yeah, we'll we'll have to see how we'll. Uh, how will end this? Apparently it wasn't enough with uh, with just no. We have two. I need I need another Carrick actually. That's that's just annoying. Let's build a Carrick and also at the time go this down. No need to have full ship maintenance when I don't even use the ships. So yeah, that's that sucks. But uh, we should be okay. I'll just go ahead and uh, freeze time. Kind of a lucky break, finally actually, claims on our rivals, we have managed to produce very legitimate documents to show it via directly claim on one of the provinces. Uh, actually double luck, because uh, we got a core up here now, on uh, Yucatan, and that basically means that we can start colonizing everywhere here, and these islands are very, very much what I want to colonize. And not only that, it means I can actually move my capital over here uh, very soon, so... Just because I want it ASAP, we'll go ahead and do this. Uh, we'll also uh, create a thousand more men to uh, to be sure that we can actually win. 
So we'll probably take a couple of years before we can actually uh, try and take the province back, but it's quite nice that we actually have uh, have a uh, have a core up here now. Hopefully they won't remove it, but uh, it's not really a rich province either, I believe. So yeah, could have made better that we have maintained uh, shipping rules. We claim Yucatan. Uh, yeah, I believe I still have a truce with these guys. Yeah, for a little longer. Let's see. Third of December. So yeah. I could try and do a little bit of a a dirty move I guess you could call it uh, we'll go ahead and move that thousand men up there and here we'll just drop off a longbow unit and we'll simply try to siege things uh, rather quickly and I hope that uh, it'll be enough to uh, stand, stand back for a while at least a uh, revolt in Peton still it went actually downwards, which is kind of neat. I'll still wait until my army is fully uh, fully reinforced and perhaps a little longer than that, so we'll see what we'll do. I was lucky with my general as well. I got a uh, four shock general, this guy. He's only has four shock though, so he ain't that good. He's good, but he ain't that good. We'll also do another move towards uh, plutocracy. A noble regiment in Okinawa. Uh, what the hell is it they want? Uh, Yeah, we'll probably have to send our troops home to deal with them later on, maybe, probably. But still, for now, we'll we'll uh, go ahead and uh, I should have waited. I should have waited. We'll go ahead and declare a uh, war on them. We'll go ahead just and declare a trade, trade dispute because I believe I can seize the province, and if not, it doesn't really matter either way. We'll just try and be quick, be subtle about it. Uh, they're actually hiring mercenaries, it seems. And I cannot do that. Can we go ahead, seize it. Place our armies up here. We have reclaimed it. Keep our capital safe. Yes, we're now accepting Mayan. That's also quite nice. We'll place our guys up here. Or no, we'll place them here. I believe. I don't know if the fortress gives any bonuses, but I hope so. Oh, yeah. This is going to get quite dicey. Let's see if we can... No, no, oh. I was scared. I was real scared. I thought I didn't have anyone, uh, anyone uh, trying to. Uh, uh, what is it? Uh, I thought I have maintenance at zero, so that could have uh, really screwed me over. But I think this will screw me over anyways. I'll just have to wait and see. We lost a thousand men. They have lost six. Still, our morale is what screws us over. The siege of Okinawa. Keep up. Maintain shipping routes. Siege of Honduras is over. Still, it seems that we will win this battle, so... Yeah, we want 11,000 of their men gone. We'll just do a little run. Simply to try and uh, siege some provinces and regain some uh, morale. And we should probably... Can I actually offer these guys a white piece? Would not accept. Yeah, I wouldn't expect it either. Probably end up filling up a lot of troops here, but there we go. We had some luck. As long as I can destroy them before they actually unite. Did he just get built there? Uh, land gain. One. Uh, we'll go towards Peyton. Then we'll go towards Belisa. Shit. Can I offer you a tribute like... Nope. Let's see, let's see, let's see. No, they aren't interested. Hmm. Still, this army should be able to take down an 11,000 mercenary army, but anything more than that could be quite tricky, I guess. Uh, yeah, they'll they'll probably lose this one. We'll have to see. Uh, my guys, that is. What is it that you want? We'll go ahead and accept. I don't really have any choice in uh, exactly that matter because uh, 
it's not really too much I can't really do anything else there it's it's just too pitiful but still uh, it will take us now five six years to just gain the money to move the capital and then we'll start uh, and then we'll start colonizing still it we will be missing a few a few uh, things when we want first start uh, impossible I'll have to stop by the Inca stand I think they will get grant me yeah they will grant me military access so we'll stop by the Incas and park there so for now we'll just go on and see what we can do unfortunately this will be the end of this episode we had to put blood price for that uh, core but uh, we got it in the end and uh, we'll move a capital here once we have a thousand coins uh, with a little luck it shouldn't be that long through and I should also go ahead before I end it and uh, send some guys to Mexico I don't get why I'm locked out of Nanjing doesn't make any sense still uh, we'll go ahead uh, do this we'll go ahead and do that as well uh, I I get it sorry it's because of uh, these rebels so next time we'll deal with them uh, thank you for watching and if you enjoyed this please leave a comment some praise criticism and also about my stupidity with uh, the Aztecs so forth and I'll see you soon